Hi everyone, this is Miss Maria from Food Corps. Today we're going to be doing a soil experiment. For this experiment, you are going to need a jar or you can use a plastic water bottle, something clear that you can put a cover on. Um, and you're going to fill it up halfway with water like I did here. The next thing you'll need is some soil. Make sure to get a grown-up's permission before you start digging. In my soil, I noticed some small rocks, leaves, sticks, and little tiny roots. Your soil might look a little bit different. All you're going to do is pour your soil into the water, and you're going to want to do this outside, so it might be a little bit messy. So once you put enough soil to fill it about halfway, you're going to put your cover on the jar or your bottle, nice and tight, and then you're going to shake it up like this. So the next part is that you're going to have to wait overnight. So put this somewhere where you won't touch it, you won't disturb it. And then we're going to come back tomorrow and see what it looks like. Now it's the next day and we're going to take a look at our soil. So overnight, a lot of the soil settled to the bottom. So we have soil, the water, and then we have a layer on the top. So let's look a little bit closer. This layer floating on the top is called humus. It's formed by the breakdown of leaves, sticks, grass, things like that. The water here has minerals in it, which is the reason we can't see through. Now let's look at the layers that settled on the bottom. The top layer looks like a thin line. This is called clay. It's made up of the tiniest soil particles. The next layer is called silt. It's also made up of very small particles. The bottom layer is made up of sand and maybe some small rocks. These are the heaviest things that have sunk to the bottom of the jar. It may be hard to tell the difference between the silt layer and the sand layer, but if you look closely, you can see that the sand is made up of bigger particles. This is a great experiment to look at the different parts of soil. Have fun trying it at home.